Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I want to show you how we can create a country map from XYZ data or from latitude, longitude, and altitude. As you see, I have this data XYZ or long, lat, and altitude. So first, I have to save it as. But I want to create a folder, specific folder for it. In disk E, new folder. Create D E M okay C S D and you could choose C S D M S D O S save it save it yes and go to uh, G I S from file add data add X Y data here first we have to Connect it to the folder to the RGIS. Choose the folder to which you want to connect it. Okay. This PC. New volume. Uh, new volume E. And my folder. Delete DM. Okay. That is the file I have. Select it. Here for X field, select it side T field on X axis, okay. In Y field, select Y axis and in Z, select it, uh, altitude M. And also we have to apply a specific coordinate system for our data. From edit. Okay, that's all the coordinate systems from world. Select it. WGS 1984. Okay. Yes, that's the data I have. Now we have to convert it to a TIN file. TIN file. So, uh, write TIN. Or it's better to write create. TIN select it okay first select the path output path 3DM not this one E 3DM okay TIN Save. Coordinate optional input feature. We have to input this one, and here we have to select it uh, altitude M to high field mass point as it is. This one as it's okay. Just click OK. Now we created the TIM file, and we have to convert the TIM file to raster. Here we have also uh, TIN to raster. You can select this one or you can write TIN to raster. Search for uh, TIN to raster. Select it TIN. Just uh, click OK. OK. Now we click it our uh, DM file from XYZ. If I uncheck this to one you see that is the dim and also i can uh, change some properties for it right click properties i want to change the color apply gamma stretch uh, also i want to apply a cold hot color for example this one apply Okay, you see the high uh, elevation is 654.9 Oscars and the low elevation is 228.52. That's the DM file from XYZ. This is DM file. This is also a DM file but a different one. But in the same way, we can, you, uh, we can create a DM file. I just combined it in my previous tutorial. Uh, to create a DM file and in this one 
I keep continue to create a control. Okay, now we created uh, a DM file as PC. Then just from search, search for control. Yes, control and insert a DM. Okay, interval 20 meters. It depends on you. For me, it's a large area, and the difference is about 300 centimeters. Interval depends on you. Okay. Now we created a contour lines, but we can make it more smooth by smooth. Search for smooth in search bar. Okay, smooth, smooth line, input contour, that's the location where you want to save your output file. We have a different uh, algorithm, I choose pick. And regarding the smoothing tolerance, you have to uh, change, the, uh, you have to pick up or select the unit, I select meter. Smoothing tolerance. My area about 3,000 or 4,000 kilometers square, so I select 10 meter. Okay. Now this one is more smooth. Okay. This one more smoother. Like how it's not a big difference in my work because. It's too much, 4,000 kilometers square, a large area. That's why you can't see a, a difference clearly. Regarding the label, right click, property, select it, or take label feature in this layer. And from label field, select control, size, you can increase it, color, which color you prefer. Uh, I selected black one and placement properties let be perpendicular place it one label per feature place one label per feature font label is on the line not above the line and this is one important position of the label on the line okay I think it's good apply Yes, that's the control map we created. Uh, I've got not clear uh, because the background color, we can't change it. Properties, symbology. If I choose this color. Okay, now it's good. I hope it can be helpful. Have a nice time.